One of our goals is to expand our canine program. Currently, we have four uh, canines. One of those is assigned to our narcotics investigators. One of those is assigned to our schools. We have two that do more patrol type uh, functions. Uh, we would like to get two more canines uh, for a total of six. The amount that you're seeing includes um, not only the purchase of the animals, but the needed things to, to get us through the rest of the year, insurance, dog food, kennels, uh, things of that nature. And we're asking that uh, we be allowed to use asset forfeiture funds for this. So it would be no, no money to the general fund. Okay. I have a motion and a second to adopt this ordinance, appropriating asset forfeiture funds for police department. Any further discussion? That's an expensive dog. Yes. There, uh, we haven't determined who we're going to go with right now because the company that we normally use was based out of Little Rock. The owner passed away last year, um, so obviously we won't be going there. We're looking at different ones. They're going to they're going to run probably between thirteen five and sixteen five for a dog. So oh, a eh, little bit more than, than what we've paid in the past, but everything's going up. Yeah. I had a chance to see one of them in action for the youth leadership program. It's amazing what these dogs can they do. Absolutely. He wasn't they chasing you, was he? Huh? Hmm? He wasn't chasing you, was he? He was not chasing me. Okay. He was not <laughs> sniffing me. He did not hey, halt they, and look at me. <laughs> hey, they got more training than Garrett's got. <laughs> uh, Chief Tapley, Chief Tapley, actually, I was, I was bothering him. I have a legitimate, I think, legitimate question, um, and I think transparency is so important um, in our government um, in, on every level. And in this extra equipment and everything, will one of those pieces of equipment possibly be a properly sized bite suit that would uh, help 25% of your canine unit. And I'm saying one out of four, but that's 25%. Um, it doesn't really matter. I just feel like if we're talking about safety, when it comes to training dogs and uh, having them bite you and, and do all this, and let's just lay it out. We. Do what now? Do what, do what? What? What was, what was the first part of the question? I, 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 did, I was asking if this equipment that they're talking about buying along with the dogs. Mm -hmm. So, to my understanding, the canine officers will work with the dogs mm -hmm. and, you know, practice biting. But the bite suits are custom made and they're. Uh, basically starts at medium, goes up to like extra, extra large or something. There's no small. So you got someone in mind that needs a small? Yeah. Okay, who is it? You know her. It's a girl. Well, you're talking about <laughs> Okay, let's, no, let's, I'll be let's, 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 let's move on, please. Well, I, I, that wasn't all of my question. Well, when sure, I'm to answer your question, we, we provide the proper equipment. Okay, so, I mean... <sighs> I, I'm just very uncomfortable with all of this, and part of it is that I don't think any of the officers, I mean, were the police officers of Coleman Department, did they know you were coming here tonight to do this? They I mean, don't. They didn't. They didn't, okay. Um, is that typical? Don't uh, you? Yes, ma'am. I make the decisions as okay. to the running of the department and what the goals of the department are, so therefore... This has been a long-standing goal, so yes. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm not trying to be disrespectful to no, you in any way. I think Conway Police, I have the highest respect for our law enforcement. Um, we couldn't do it without you. Mm -hmm. And quite literally, my business could not do it without you. Um, however, I'm just, I'm uncomfortable seeing that there are some pending litigations against the city and the PD at this moment by two different people. And one of those... Excuse me, I, I hate to interrupt you, Ms. Mm -hmm. Webb. We are not going to talk about pending litigation against the city in this in this meeting right here, right now. Okay. We we don't have to. I'm not trying to. I don't know anything. Well, you, I, but you just mentioned it. 
Yeah. Okay. That's that's where we need to stop. Because on, Conway on, on this, citizens this don't need to know about it. We just need to stop this line of questioning. This is not the time or place. And so I'm being told to shut up. Okay. Okay. Okay, we have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? Mr. Garrett. Mr. Hawkins? Yes. Mr. Ledbetter? Yes. Mr. Jones? Yes. Mr. Grimes? Aye. Ms. Tucker? Yes. Ms. Webb? No. Ms. Isby? Yes. Ms. Mel? Passes seven to one.